All right, I just want to make a quick video showing how to turn on Secure Boot and RTPM if you're using an AMD CPU. So first thing you want to do is load in your BIOS. Um, on my motherboard, it's clicking the delete key whenever the main screen pops up. Uh, you want to make sure you're in advanced mode. It looks like this. And you want to go over to settings, come down to advanced, come down to Windows operating system configurator, and you want to make sure you're in UEFI mode right here. Um, if you're in CSM, you'll want to go ahead and switch it over. And then if you come down to secure boot, click on that. And you want to make sure the system mode is in user. Um, if it's in setup mode, uh, the easiest way to change it is to come down here, click standard, click custom, click back to standard. And it'll ask you if you want to load factory defaults, say yes. And then that should allow you to click enable. And then if you come back to settings here and go to security, and then you can come down here to trusted computing, click on that. As you can see, mine's disabled. If you click there, and you can click enable, and then you should be good to go now. And you can go ahead and close out of the BIOS, uh, say yes to your changes, and they should both be configured. After you've closed the BIOS the first time, um, I recommend going back into it again and making sure everything enabled properly. Uh, so you can go over here to settings again, uh, go to advanced windows os configuration and then secure boot and as you can see it's still enabled here and if you go back to settings then security down to trusted computing and now you can see that a tpm device was found firmware version the vendor and um, other information down here uh, you shouldn't need to modify any of this stuff but uh, if you want to um, just be aware that something could get messed up by doing that